You want to say hello? You want to say hello, everyone? Look over here. Say hello. Hello, beautiful world. Welcome back, or welcome to the Morgan Clubhouse, also known as my YouTube channel. And today I have little Itchy. Can you say hi, Itch? This is little Itchy. Oh, he's giving kisses. I love it so much when he gives kisses. See that? That right there. That right there is a huge, huge. What are you doing? Is a huge win in the magical vibe department here because today today we are going to do something a little bit different here over in the morgan clubhouse and that is we're gonna do a weekly roundup and a nice little chit chat with y'all because you know what i'm just so freaking inspired right now with the amount of gratitude that i feel for having YouTube be here right now, not only, not only for being a place to get information, like how to take care of a skinny piggy, or the makeup reviews I watch, the carnivore videos, the keto videos, I mean, the gaming videos, there's just so much information and so much entertainment here that I have consumed throughout the years. I figure, oh my goodness, what can I offer to kind of just complete like the little ecosystem circle here? And what I realized, oh, do you agree, Bubba? I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm sorry. It's going to be one of those videos because this is a video where I want to be talking with my friends. And you are genuinely my friends. And I'm getting there right now because, like I said, I wanted to create videos so I can share my experiences just like what I've been gifted from the rest of you that make videos and that chit chat in the comments and join communities. And I feel like, I guess I feel like, I feel like since I have been back here creating videos every day, I started with the handstand challenge and that was because Miss Terry Least had, she does like these amazing videos, like every single day she's able to put together these beautiful vlogs where she is so authentic and she just shares her experience in life and it helps so many others. And I've been chit chatting with her down in the comments along with others that I had met in other communities, like look at Carnivore. I ended up joining his private community and I cannot tell you how freaking amazing the friends, the friendships, the relatability without judgment is just absolutely magical. And I'm just so grateful. And I wanted to thank each and every one of you. And I also wanted then to start a place here on my channel where we can chit chat and go over like what our week is like, what our day is like. If you want to complain about something, if you want to share your greatest accomplishments, it doesn't matter what it is. If you and me make we and we're friends, we are friends. And it doesn't matter if it's through technology on YouTube or if you have your friends in real life, there are many of us out there that don't leave the house for like weeks, but are so fulfilled because they are creating love in the light. And that's kind of where I come from. And yeah, I definitely have been under the weather for a while now. And um, it's definitely changed my perspective on so many things. It really has. However, when one of my beautiful subscribers asked me, what was your week like? I thought that was one of the kindest things somebody could ask. It just is like, it's just beautiful. 
And then I was asked, it kind of, this kind of ties in now to the weekly roundup. And it also ties into, I won't be going over this stuff anymore. This is like the first video where I'm going to explain why I'm making the video. And then after that, right, Itchy? We're just going to do it. Hopefully, hopefully, um, enough of you, one, just one, would want to watch and interact with me too, because I have found just the greatest friends here, like I said before. And so I did want to say thank you so much to all of you beautiful souls that have asked me if I was okay after taking my little boy to UCLA this week. And I gotta be honest with you, at first I was like super excited. And then as I was leaving, you guys, it's crazy. Because like here, let me get back to that. On Monday, Linda, for the weekly roundup real quick. Lindsay came down, she's my oldest, from LA to get her hair done. And she came by real quick and had dinner with us. We chit-chatted and we were able to, like, it was so awesome. We were able to just catch up on things. You know, it's so different when you get to see your babies. And what was funny is she actually held itchy and scratchy too. She's allergic to, like, hairy guinea pigs. But these ones, did she just poop on me? Oh my gosh, you guys, the show must go on. This is real life. You poo pooed on me. Thank goodness your poo poo isn't that bad. I know, you're so sweet. Do you want a treat? So Lindsay came by. She held itchy and scratchy. And um, it was pretty funny. I'm giving him a pee flake. I am filming right in front of a window with no lighting on my phone. So if it ends up being a little funky, you know why. But I think most of us here, we completely understand, right? Right. Is that good? He's loving it. I got some happy little vegans living in my house, that's for sure. You want some more? Okay. So she came by she came by on Monday and that's a happy win. And then on Wednesday we drove up to LA. And we stayed in a hotel, the Embassy Suites over by LAX, which I did like, I did a full room tour and also filmed some airplanes that were traveling like right above us on our way to in and out Oh my gosh, you guys, because they do have an in and out pretty close to like our hotel. So we were walking there and as we were walking, oh my gosh, I was like too busy, like looking at the airplanes. Yeah. So I was looking at the airplanes and they were like landing around and I was like, oh, that's so cool. And then bam, I did a face plant over a curb. It was freaking funny, you guys. Like I was just grateful that I only like cut up my hand or whatever. They had like a Ralph's and a CVS by, so I did that. And we went to in and out Do you want some more? Dang, okay. Okay, whatever you say, sir. And so then on Thursday morning, it only, like Wednesday, it only took us two hours to drive to LA from where I live, which is like magical. Trust me, that is great. No traffic. And then on Thursday, we drove on over to UCLA, got him all settled into his dorm, took a little tour of the school, and I put a little video together, which should be kind of fun. So he's off now. And what's funny about that is I am super excited about him, but like, man, I did get all the feels and I was pretty sad because I just love him so much. This little boy, did you poop again? Oh my gosh, at least you didn't pee on me. Not yet, at least. I say that, then watch, that's next. I guess I deserve it though for being on here forever. And yeah, so that is what happened on Thursday. We drove home from UCLA and it was record time once again. So I had to go by Dunkin' Donuts and get me some coffee because I freaking love their coffee. It's so good. Mm, love it. And then yesterday was Friday and Bailey came up from San Diego and she had to get her nails done. And so I got my little toes done and they always surprise me. It's so freaking funny. When I go get my toes done and my fingers, I usually don't pick the colors. And so they surprised me and they're a really pretty color. I think I made a video about it. I'm not sure. If you guys want to see them, let me know. I always claim I have the cleanest feet ever because they do such a great job. One, you, you want some more? I just don't want to get you sick, but you, oh, now he's trying to go after 
after my calluses from pole. Okay, here you go. And so, yeah, we went and had our eyebrows done. She stayed for dinner, had to run back to San Diego. And that was our weekly wrap up of what went on here at the Morgan house. And it's really weird for me to chit chat about that kind of thing because I don't want it to sound like I'm rambling on about my kids. However, when someone asks, I think it's polite to, in this little form, they can stop it and fast forward, stop it and be done with it, or just want to listen to it. And then hopefully, what fingers crossed is that you all will share what went on with you this week and where you're from and things you love, things you don't love, just everything that's going on. Because like I said before, we relate without judgment in this simple life zone. That's the way it works. So yeah, that's how it is. I would love to know, how are you? How is your summer? I heard that summer ended today. However, I just don't play. I just don't play that. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. And this is, to me, a little bit more fun to chit-chat back and back. And let me know if you'd like me to do, like, daily updates and what it is you would like to know about what it's like to live this simple life in California raising five piggies and having four amazing kiddos. And yes, my baby boy, Brandon, he lives out of state. So that's why I did not see him this week as well. But oh my gosh, I'm just so proud of all of them. And I love them so much. And I'm just so freaking inspired by you all when you ask questions. And yeah, it's awesome. But I would love to know what it is you got going on with you. And if there's anything you'd like me to share, I am an open book. If you don't feel comfortable about posting your comments in the little box below, you can always email me and we can have a conversation that is strictly nobody else needs to know. And I'm all about that life. I have no problem with that whatsoever. So if that is what you'd like, like I said, your wish is my command. And yeah, I just want this to be a fun little space where we can come and just be friends and have a great conversation. And for those of you, which this is what's really interesting too, and I'll, then I'll end this here, um, that I thought was really interesting is there are others out there I know that have expressed exactly what I have just said to you, where it's really weird where your physical friends, you see less and you talk to less and you chat and chit and all that good stuff less than you do with the beauties you've met here on YouTube or other social media outlets. I don't really... I do have a live stream, if you didn't know that, over on another platform. However, I am planning on starting to do a live stream here as well. I haven't gotten it set up yet. Obviously, you can see around me that I don't have my background, the lights, or any of that. However, really, I just feel like the vanity portion of what I've got going on right now, that's just not in the cards. We have no vanity here. And that goes for all my videos. So if it looks a little janky, it is what it is. Even if you find this video super irritating, maybe I'm cringy AF to you and it made you feel so much better that you're not living my life, I still win. Because that means I did exactly what my goal was. And I didn't waste your time. Because I don't want to be doing that. It's too precious. And you are absolutely magical. You have epic vibes. Life is not always going to be piggies and rainbows, is it? It's not always going to be a ribeye steak. Love you, vegans. Please don't be angry at me for eating meat. It is what it is. However, um, yeah, I know it's kind of rambly. And I was kind of all over the place with the video. But at the end of the day, 
I would absolutely love to know what you are up to, what you're about, what your likes and dislikes are, and just go from there. You know what I mean? We can run with it. And yeah, that's about it. If you have any ideas, if you have any kind of suggestions, please hit me up down below and let me know. Or once again, you can email me. Or if you really want to get at me like as soon as possible, DM me over on Instagram, Sherry Morgan 100. That would be me. So yeah, there you go. Super easy. I love you all to pieces. Thank you again for being here with me. If you made it this far in the video, you are a freaking legend. I love you, my little gangsters. And I'm so grateful for you. And I hope to see you very soon down in the comments and hopefully in a video. Maybe manana. I don't know. Y'all have to let me know. I love you all so much. And I hope you have a beautiful, blessed day. Love and light from Itchy. Say bye. Love and light from Itchy, my other piggies, and for me. And always remember, if someone hasn't told you today, you are freaking loved and a blessing. Love and light, everyone. See you later, Gators.